couple years ago, I realized like I was really into L's and you got these RFEs that would take forever with L's. And mm -hmm. I had to cut it all out to just do basically marriage cases because as you said, like you're, you're just paying for costs. You're not making a profit on these. And mm -hmm. so we're yeah. getting back now that I have a team of other associates and a bigger team. And it's all me getting back into it. But like, first we have to charge a lot for these cases inevitably because they are so time consuming. It's not, some people do it on the cheap, like, you know, a couple grand for something that should be like three times that. But mm -hmm. I'm like, either they're just changing the name on the case or something like that. Or I don't know. I don't know how they're doing that to make it a reasonable case. They're probably just not making enough money. Yeah. Like I don't ever give quotes to prospective clients before I talk to them, because when I talk to them, I make it clear we are not a bargain basement law firm that will do bare essentials, which sometimes that's all people want. Yeah. Um, I'm like, we are, we will hold your hand through this process. We will be on a flat fee, completely accessible to you. Like we will do a, a high quality, thoughtful product. We're not going to rush it. Um, like, obviously it's timely, but um, yeah. I just make it clear to people, like, if you want, if you're looking at attorneys to find the cheapest one that yeah. won't pass, but then, you know, you can convince people that, that actually, when they think about it, they don't want the cheapest one. They want like the most skillful, supportive one. Mm -hmm. It's such an important thing. I was on my to-do list of questions, but I skipped those just about this conversation. Like, uh, you, cause we get a lot of leads with on the price and I know I'm challenging myself to like, how do I, uh, cause they won't schedule a consultation. How do I inform them of this complexity of the situation? Sometimes, most of the time, probably these people are not going to understand anyways, if they're just asking how much the price is, because that's what they do. That's someone in a TikTok post. So yeah, call around to get the best price on one of my videos, because they're like, mm -hmm. so we'll charge a lot. But it's like, it's, it's a different thing. It could be like 99% the same, but you have one piece of information or one connection or one handholding that makes the complete difference in your life. And that's where you try, strive to do that one thing that's going to be different than the other people or, or just the, in your life. Mm -hmm.